Try to find out the volume of this cube. Okay. First, we need to find the length. Can you find the length of this figure? I'll try my best. Remember, the length measures how long it is. Oh yeah. Let's count together. One, One two, two, three, three four, four, five, six. six. This cube is six units long. Yes. All right. Now, we need to find the width. Sounds good. Can you find the width of this figure? I'll try my best. Now, really, remember, the width measures how wide it is. Let's count together. One, One two, two, and three. three. This cube is three units wide. Oh, yes. Wow, you are so smart. Thank you. Finally, we need to find the height. Can you find the height of this figure? I'll try my best. Remember, the height measures how high it is. Okay, okay. Let's count it together. One, One two... two. Three, Three, four, four five, five six. six. This cube is six units high. Oh, yes. I just don't believe how smart you are. Whoa. Thank you. Now that we have found the length, width, and height, we can find the volume of this three-dimensional figure. Let's go to the drawing board. All right. Remember, though, if you multiply the length times the width times the height, you will get the volume of a figure right. Hey, that rhymes. You're right. Let's look at it. The length equals six units long. The width equals three units wide. And the height equals six units high. Now we need to multiply them. Six times three times six equals 108 cubic units. We did it! All right! Yes! 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 Can I have a candy bar? Yes! Yes! Oh, no. Oh, I tricked you. Oh, man. <laughs>